Our seventh grade author is Delaney Black. She's from Scott Valley Junior High School in Siskiyou County. Her story is titled From Dirt to Pie Crest. and two minutes later, Dad comes in. Get up and get dressed, Dad says he walks out, 6.45 a.m. I rub my eyes groaning. I want to stay in bed. I get up and get ready, trying to wake my, myself up while getting dressed. Hurry up and eat, Dad says. I finish eating while walking out the door promptly at 7 a.m. My job is to irrigate the wheat and alfalfa by moving the wheel lines on our family farm. I live on a farm that grow, grows organic alfalfa and wheat. Organic means you don't use any chemicals. We irrigate the wheat until the middle of July. I hurry out to the four-wheeler and head to the field with the cool morning air and mosquitoes hitting my face. Every morning, sometimes midday and night, I change water on our family farm. I turn off the first pipe, wait for it to drain while turning off the others. I move the first, then walk to the second, and so on. Lastly, I hook them back up and start them. I get nervous while turning the on the wheel lines because that is when something will go wrong. As the wheel line fills and the water pressure increases, a riser can blow or a pipe latch can unhook. The result is a mushroom cloud of water blowing up in the air, Dad driving across the field towards me at 40 miles an hour and 30 more minutes of work. I know because I have done that mistake before. Later in the day, I go out again and do the start, start the same process all over again. The humid heat is torture during the day, and I feel like my clothes are wet from sweat. It is so hot that I get really frustrated while hooking the old pipes up, and I just can't wait to be done. It feels great to be sprayed by the cold sprinklers after they have filled, and there are no problems. After dinner, I go out and change wheel lines for the third time of the day, but this time I go out and help irrigate <coughs> other fields. Wheat needs to be irrigated until the middle of July. I love watching the wheat turn from green to brown. When the wheat heads fill and the crops start to turn brown, Dad says we don't have to irrigate the fields anymore. It's pretty tough. My uncle and Dad harvest the wheat until the middle of August and put it in our grain for storage. We grind the wheat, we store on the flour and sell it to bakeries in the local community. I help my dad run the wheat through the cleaner and sit in there sometimes when he grinds the wheat into flour. The cleaner is a machine that separates the wheat seeds from other seeds. <coughs> Small pieces of straw and wheat holes. My favorite part though is when we take some flour and I have my mom bake pies and bread. I love the homemade bread. Cinnamon bread is the best. It's so good it makes my mouth water just thinking about it. On our farm we enjoy watching the wheat grow from seeds, cleaning in the dirt to pie crust that melts in our mouths. 